A local college student is being recognized by the American Heart Association for her efforts to improve health and wellness in the community. And I got a chance to speak with her about how she's making a difference and why it is so important. I do want to go on to grad school and go into medicine. Case Western Reserve University sophomore Elizabeth Onyekwere is on a mission to help others live their best lives. When someone close to her was diagnosed with a heart problem, she started researching. I was on the American Heart Association website for like hours looking at different um, types of surgeries they would possibly get or like looking into the procedures and that's when I found the Empowered to Serve um, program and how they want to be able to make healthcare, I guess, accessible to everyone. Elizabeth submitted an application on a whim. So when you applied for it, did you think you would win or you just said, well, let me just try, let me just throw it out there? Yes, that's definitely what I was thinking. <laughs> so Elizabeth was surprised when she was selected for the American Heart Association's Empowered Scholars Program. The association's executive director that's in right. Cleveland, Valerie Gates, to told me Elizabeth yeah. is one of just 10 students in the country this year to receive the honor, which includes a $5,000 scholarship. So what stands out about Elizabeth? So I love that as a student and amongst her peers, she's trying to help with the mental health resources and take away some of the stigma that might exist. One thing I do is definitely take time for myself. I definitely also prioritize mental health. And that's important because more young people than ever are struggling with depression and anxiety. What do you think is happening with people your age when it comes to mental health? I think what's going on from what I can understand is sometimes it's hard to identify if you really need help. And I definitely think that's a issue among like adolescents or people in academia think that their mental health isn't important or their grades or something else is more important than how they feel. Elizabeth works with Case Western Reserve University's counseling services and wellness programs, helping other students access the support they may need. I just wanted to be able to destigmatize and let people know that they can reach out for help if they want to and that there's resources out there and that someone will help them and will listen to them. Yes, they will. The American Heart Association has awarded more than $200,000 in scholarships to students like Elizabeth since 2018. I got to tell you, she's a very delightful young woman, very convicted about, you know, I got to get this message out here to young people. Yes. And I love, as people know, the mental health component that she takes care of herself and she wants other young people to know you need to take care of your mind as well. Yeah, an important example yes. for young people. Well, really for all of us. Yes, for all of us. Protect yes. your peace. Protect your peace. All right.